I've got one of Cooper's hairs in my lens. Hello everyone, welcome to the vlog. We are just about to go to my family home to celebrate my brother's 30th birthday. So this morning we've just been packing, trying to sort the house out, and I also finished decorating Tom's birthday cake. So I actually started this yesterday and then I did the, all of the buttercream and everything this morning. So I thought I would just pop in the clips of me making the cake here. forgot to film actually doing all of the buttercream but I thought I would just show you very quickly because we need to set off the cake because I absolutely love it so this is the cake look how amazing it looks this is a coffee and walnut gluten-free cake and I just love it so much it smells incredible and then I also got these 30 candles as well so we can light those a little bit later on um, but I really enjoyed making it and I've got this cake carrier let me show you one second I've got this cake carrier this is from Hobbycraft and it's actually perfect if you are transporting a cake to somewhere else. And a little tip, if you put a little bit of buttercream on, on like underneath the cake before you start icing it, like basically directly on the bottom of here, it will help to keep the cake stuck to the bottom as you're transporting it to where you need to go. What do you think of the cake? It looks amazing. Do you think? Like you don't really, you don't make that kind of cake very often, do you? So like no. you, it, the fact that it's so neat, you've done so well. Thank you. I also have another couple of bits to show you very quickly before we go. I also got some new plants from Patch Plants that are absolutely beautiful. This one is a limited edition one, so if you do like the look of this one, then you need to be quick because once they've sold out, they've sold out basically. But I just love the pattern on the leaves on this one. This one is called Mac. And this is the pot that I went for, which is actually stunning. It's kind of like a neutral colour, but it's got these um, like speckles on it. It's got kind of a rough texture, and I love it. Next one, this is Annie, as you can see. I thought it was quite funny because this is Annie and that's Mac, so it's like Annie Mac. <laughs> Look at the leaves on this one. It literally looks like a watermelon. This one looks like it is hanging on for dear life, but... These ones just look beautiful. They have literally only just arrived, but we needed to get them out so they can at least have some light while we are at my family home for the weekend. So the plan is a very chilled day at home. I think we're doing sort of hot sandwiches, roast potatoes, things like that a little bit later on and playing some games. And then tomorrow my mum is cooking a Sunday roast dinner and hers are always the best. So I'm very much looking forward to that. I am going to take a bottle of like blush rosé but I really don't want to end up drinking too much of it to be honest because I don't think I can hack the hangovers anymore in all honesty. <laughs> and then the last couple of bits that I need to wrap very quickly for my brother for his birthday and um, so it's not his actual 30th birthday today but uh, it was on the 20th of August so but we're just celebrating it today. Uh, I got this happy birthday gift bag from Tesco there you go you can see there and then he does very much like rum and I know he likes this 
old J spiced one because it's smooth vanilla and I'm pretty sure he likes this and I've got him this before in the past. And then I also got him Catan, but the card game. So if you've never played Catan before, you absolutely should. Like the board game, it is such a good game if you like to play games with friends. This is for two to four players. I thought this would be really good because he loves Catan, but also he travels. He's traveling a lot through Europe at the moment, so he can't exactly take the, the entire Catan board game with him but maybe he has space for this so I thought that would be quite nice and then I've just got some tissue paper to wrap the stuff in put it in the gift bag pack up his presents and then I think we are pretty much ready to go Cooper has decided it's time to get in the car has he really he's, he's quite hot car. He's very, very excited because he loves Flynn. Mum and Mark's dog, Flynn, he's just absolutely obsessed with him. So Cooper's very, very excited. And let's just hope we can get the cake there in one piece. Sam looks a little bit different to normal. Oh yeah, I look like, I look, I look, if you had to now describe me, there's no way of describing me. Yes, there is. You just say that, oh, that bald guy, very nondescript. I look like Hitman. You look very you good in blue. You know who that is. Hitman, no. It's from the game. He's just bald and nondescript. It really suits you, and the blue really suits you too. Because if I had like assassinated somebody and somebody saw me do it, if they had to describe me, they'd be like, he's it's bald. <laughs> exactly, so you best watch out. <laughs> and you best watch out as well. Cooper is very, very excited. Aren't you, bird? You excited to go see Flynn? You excited? We're on the way. We're just glazing the pork. What's that? that pork. Is that it's that gammon. gammon. What's that's that? That's chicken. And this is this is pork crackling. It's in the oven. Mum's made me a gin. Oh, oh my god, they look so good. Roast potatoes. And then over here, we've got Pringles. Nacho crisps, Doritos, bread rolls. Don't eat all the pigs in blankets because they're tons of food. Outside, I thought this was Sam's plate. That's my plate. That's Sam's plate. Bring in the ball. Are you using all the Yeah. Hop, 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 hop,
This is oh, it's coffee and walnut cake. Uh, that's it. Ah, this is the recipe I used to make the cake yesterday. Shame there's no picture of it, though, isn't it? Gluten free Becky XL. Got, I've got more cookbooks than this, to be honest. Now, it's kind of like that, though, isn't yeah, it? Really? That, yeah. You're gonna start baking different cakes now. Okay. <laughs> Just watching Friends. Mum's cooking a Sunday roast, and we are about to play Catan. Yes, please. And then we'll have a game of Catan if you want. I just need to get dipping in and out just for dinner. Yes. Coffee for you? Hey, Flynn. What would you like? Uh, I'll have a cup of tea, please. Just a normal tea? Yes, please. I've got a nice green belt in the middle. Let's do a green bell all the way through the middle. Comes up. Wow. Oh yes, everyone likes four. Metal and brick. I love brick, please. Right. Drink everybody, everybody loves it when a four comes up. I would like to use my night card, which is just move the rubber. I'm gonna move it here. And <laughs> I would like to take one of your cards. <laughs> Please. Take this one. <laughs> Trade three bricks. How can you do that? Because you've got, got a special pot. For wood. Seven! Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, I've got five. Thanks, Nat. I've got six. You've got to get rid of half. Yeah, I'm, I'm just making sure I can still next turn do... Gets Would anybody like to give me no. a sheet? No, not now. Not after what you've just done. For a wood? No, you're under an embargo by the way. Why are you yeah. cooking and replacing an embargo? Wood. You've just blocked my wood, my wheat, so I'm very yeah. upset with you right now. I'm also Please upset with you. Please come out of my air road. Thank you very much. And I'm going to put my road here. <laughs> Oh. Now then, what do I do to get this? You need to you build. build a you need. Settlement. You need to build a settlement here. Is it got to be there? No. Or is it got e to be either. there? Either. Yeah, either one. Well, yeah, you need a road to go there. Yeah, yeah. I know. So no one wants to give me a shoe. No, nope, you're under an embargo. I'm not under an embargo. You are. Why? You've blocked me. You've blocked Sam. You took the cards off me. You've been nasty, basically. 
and we, you win it. We don't like how Actually, big your no. road is either. Actually, not no. it up. I'll buy another road, please. The council of elves have come together and we don't like it. Because no one's going to steal my longest road now. I'm oh like my. champion. Oh, <laughs> it's on the embargo bite. You do know that I can spit in your dinner. Oh. <laughs> Tom Williams. Yeah. They built another city and he had a victory point there. Well done, Tom. Oh, thanks. I, I was to, close. I was very close like to getting another oh three rolls to get the to get the card for the roads with my little uh, empire. Are we having dinner on his knees? Yep. I, I think the way that you started with his <laughs> knees though. Oh, that's good. I think Tom uh, Tom's disqualified for unfair play. <laughs> that was just a smart play. Look what I did for love. Excuse me. They look good though, Yorkshire for doing that, I think. I know, no. but for now. Parsnips. Look at Sam's. That looks amazing. It's mine. Yeah. Then we've got some cheese sauce. Oh, Russell's gone off. Oh, he's got some data. Hamilton's going to have me. Hamilton and Russell. Very smart from the two McLaren drivers. Piastri tucked in. Oh! In the slipstream. And then they didn't squabble. Oh two. my god! Piastri's gone round him! Second chicane. Squabbling and Piastri. Well, that is unbelievable. Lewis under pressure. And Charles Leclerc now comes through. Oh, he's the first place. Piastri literally forced Norris out the way. Wow. Wow, that is gloves off. The loveliest weekend with family for Tom's birthday. There's absolutely no cake left. Everyone enjoyed it so much. I definitely think I might make that again. It was the Becky XL gluten-free recipe and I think I might try some more of her recipes too because that one turned out really well. I'll leave the link in the description below in case you are celiac or you are trying to avoid gluten for any reason. Tom absolutely loved loved Catan, the card game. So that was the game that you will have seen us just playing. Just absolutely loves that game and he will be going traveling, he's going to Thailand soon and he can take the card version of it. And with Catan it's one of those that you need like a lot of people to play whereas the card game version is two to four players so it's great if you want to try and play uh, with your partner, a friend. I think me and Sam might get the card game for ourselves because it does look really good. We also really enjoyed watching F1. It's not something that me and Sam have ever really been into. My mum and Mark are absolutely F1 obsessed. Like they've been to see it in person so many times and they were explaining to us when we were watching it what was actually going on. But now we're home and we have actually just had HelloFresh delivered. We've been doing HelloFresh again now for a good couple of weeks and it's actually going really really well this week we have family favorite butter chicken and basmati rice we love the butter chicken one it is so nice to be honest i'm not really like a huge fan of curry but this butter chicken one is so good so whenever i see that one i always pick it this one looks insane oh my gosh so this is peri peri chicken burger with spiced halloumi fries 
halloumi fries. Look. Look at that. That just looks so good. The next one is midweek chipotle beef rigatoni. I love all of the rigatoni pasta ones. Look at that. That looks so good. Last one, spiced barbecue pork quesadillas. Again, 20 minutes. So this week they're all quite quick. Sam's going to absolutely love this one and the burger as well. First of all, I get out five containers like this for the fridge and I basically just pop the ingredients for each meal into here. They already come packaged in here, but then I just have to add the items for the fridge from this section. put them all into the trays what I basically do is double check all of the meat and see when it's going to go out of date start a new week and then what I do is essentially write the dates down here so I know when everything's going to go off by and then based on that I will order like which meals we're going to have when I also base it around Sam's shifts and also when we're going to the gym as well in the evenings because I will generally go for the quicker ones on the days that we go to the gym and then I will then put the number on here I'll put the matching number of the tray so I know which one's which I always pick the HelloFresh recipes. I always like to show Sam and get his reaction. Or I like the theme like midweek school night. It's because it's back to school, isn't it? Ah, that looks like a good, nice, easy, quick one. Oh, hell yes. The curries from HelloFresh are always so good. We always say how much we love them, don't we? Mm -hmm. Nice, mild spice. Spiced barbecue pork. You've definitely given me these in like a, an order of, <laughs> of not as good to good. <laughs> That's amazing. Do we get three each? I don't know. Oh, so I hope so. That looks well good. And last but not least. Oh, spiced food <laughs> fries. Oh. Oh, good choice this week. I know, I'm quite happy this week. We've got some good ones. We're just off um, chocolate sweets, more chocolate biscuits, and snacks off the shopping list. If you just want to add that on now. Yeah, if you just want to add, add that on now. Just want to add, add it on, that on that. On the shopping list, you just said, it's not add. <laughs> right there. Why have you put this in my hand? Chalk. Darling, you've messed up my nice, neat list now. Chocolate times a hook. We're not getting chocolate times because I'm 10,000. Oh, I'm trying to cut back, aren't I? So. I've done that thing again where I've got hiccups and I'm filming, so I'm going to have to edit out all the hiccups. I am going to end this vlog here because it's been a very chilled weekend, but there's been a lot going on. So I think we're just going to chill. I think I might leave you on a nice evening montage of our evening, but I think I might have a bit of a self-care evening. I think I might have a nice lush bath bomb and we'll light the candle. I think we're going to have an early night. We've got this vlog in the vlog then thank you so much for being here i appreciate you so much don't forget to subscribe if you're not already hit the notifications bell icon so that you never miss an upload don't forget to give the video a thumbs up too because it really helps to push my videos out there i will see you all very soon <laughs>